Hey everybody, how you doing out there? It's yours, uh, yours truly talking to you in the middle of the night. I'm not telling you what time in the middle of the night, but sometime in the middle of the night I'm talking to you guys. And I'm um, talking to you guys for a reason. And the reason is, there's a song uh, from the early 80s. Uh, this is from 1985 to 1986. This song came out in that era. This song and uh, the rock group, uh, the name of the song, uh, the, actually the name of the rock group, which you're going to know in a few minutes, is called Pursuit of Echo. Now, if you don't know about the rock group, it came around uh, 85, 86, around that time frame. And 87, I think around 87. Now, I'm not mistaken here. I think it was 87. Time around 86 to 87. The song was called uh, Funky Town. Now, it was from a group called Pursuit of Echo. You may have heard about it. There's a lot of guitaring into this whole song. Uh, a lot of drum playing, keyboarding, uh, musical keyboards um, playing on the song. It was a very, very good song. Uh, but I think, I think uh, Lip Sync, I guess they call it Lip Sync or something. Some original band, uh, original group did the song originally. And then Pursuit Echo kind of did their version to it and, uh, and put it on their album. And with, they did Funky Town. It's the same, same, almost the same version, but uh, different uh, group. So, in, in, I think it was Imp Sync, um, or Lip Sync, whatever, whatever the group is called. Anyway, it was original from the early 70s, but Pursuit of Echo did their version with a lot of guitar riffing. Uh, I mean, riffing mean in terms of... Uh, really it's kind of like a loop they made the guitar sound like a loop in a way if you know what i mean in samplers they get loops um so what the guitar did in that very special song if you don't know the song already i'll give you a big sample of it uh, this is the sample with how the song went it went I got love Take me to a funky town with you to meet to a funky town. It went like that. So uh, there's a little bit of guitar in it, a little bit of drums, uh, and the guitar sound like there's a loop on it. Uh, they made the guitar, uh, the gui uh, uh, electric guitar sound like it looped. It looped through the whole song. So the whole entire song kind of looped. And all the way through, all the way through the song. But uh, was most important to the song was it actually was the extended version of that song. So there you go, guys. Um, the very much song that made it popular Eight, way back in '80s, way back in um, '87, '87, '86. And it's just pseudo echo they call it Funk Town. It was a it's a well known song out there and these are just British guys uh doing a song called Funky Town and made them popular and made the name popular. So I'm gonna mention here for you guys. Anyway, that's all you guys have to know and yeah, Funky Town in its own way. It took over about eight minutes or seven minutes to do the song. Extended version on that one. The twelve inch version of Funky Town. And um, maybe later on today I might play it. It's a good song. It's a good song. A lot of guitar uh, riffs in it. And it, it's like a loop in the song. They used the guitar as a loop. Uh, so they really looped it really good. Um, so anyway, just, uh, the song was great. I would highly recommend you people go listen to it. Uh, it's really, really good. The drum beats on it, it's really good. The singer was really good on it. And uh, I, would, I would advise anybody out there, go try the song. The group is called Pursuit of Echo. I know, it's just two words, Pursuit of Echo. And uh, yeah, it was a British band. It was a very much a British band. But they put they put their stamp of approval called Funky Town, the song. Oh, it was originally done in the 70s, but they revamped it in the early 80s. Uh, from the 87, but they had a British band called Pasuka Echo to do it. And they put a lot of guitar sounds to it, a lot of drum playing, a lot of uh, musical keyboard to it, and it sounds really good. It sounds really, really good. Very funky drum beat they got going. 
and uh, it was really good at the time. So go check it out, 87 to 86, sometime around there. And it really uh, took notice of this band. And uh, I'll tell you about it further as days go on. So there.